Hey, what up YouTubers? It's your boy Alter Tech. I'm back again with a new video. And today we have the OnePlus 7 Pro and I'm recording with the OnePlus 7T. And in today's video, I want to talk about Gcam because Gcam with the OnePlus 7 series has been a pain in the butt. Uh, usually it's kind of hard to find the right Gcam. And once you find the right Gcam, maybe there's a software update. Like for example, we had Android 10. And when that came out, that completely broke all the previous Gcams. And then you had to wait for another Gcam to actually come out. And that, and that wasn't as good as a previous one. So it's been kind of hectic. And when it comes to portrait mode, it hasn't been as good as I thought it was going to be. So I did post a video. It was titled the best Gcam for the OnePlus 7 Pro. Well, you know, time has passed and that's definitely not the best Gcam you could probably get. So I'll try to update that video. Now you guys can keep up to date with the latest Gcam. There is a Telegram group and they have a ton of extensive tools and information for anyone who is just starting out with a Gcam. So let's go ahead and get to that real quick. So I'll post the Telegram group into the description. Okay, so let's go ahead and dive inside. So this is the Telegram group and there is a pinned message up on top. All you gotta do is click on that and here you have everything you need. You have the best settings, you have the downloads for your Gcam, you have frequently asked questions, you have the Gcam 7 tutorials, and a module for auxiliary. So there's a ton of cool things. So just to simplify everything, let's say you're running Android 10 because everyone should be on Android 10 right now, hopefully. So just tap on best settings and it will take you to this link over here where it says Gcam Android 9, Gcam Android 10. Tap on the one for Android 10 if you're running Android 10. So then what you want to do is you want to open it, start downloading it. I've already done so. So once you have it completely downloaded, I want you guys to go ahead and open it up. But if you do have a Gcam that was previously installed on your device, you have to go ahead and clear the storage and clear the cache before you do anything else. And if you don't know how to do that, it's quite simple. Just uh, find your Gcam app over here, hold it down, tap on app info, and tap on storage and cache. And what I want you guys to do is to clear the cache and then clear the storage. And once you have that completely done, go ahead and uninstall your app like so. And I'll just do it just for demonstration. And then once you're done with doing that, open up the file manager, go into your downloads, and tap on your downloaded the 6.2 Gcam Arnova. Click on install. <clears throat> And now it should be installing. It shouldn't take too long. Okay, so once the app has been installed, I want you guys to go ahead and tap on open. And allow the permissions. Click OK. And you know, I'll give you guys a test shot right now. And let's see how that looks. Okay, so as you guys can see, the photo looks very unsaturated. And what you guys need to do right now is go ahead and find a XML file. And I'll teach you guys how to do that right now using the Telegram chat. So go ahead and open up Telegram, open up the chat, and it should say XML right over here. Go ahead and tap on it, open it, and it's going to ask you, do you want to download it? Okay, so I want you guys to tap on download. Okay, so once you have the file downloaded, I want you guys to go into your file manager. Okay, so what you do is you gotta tap on storage down on the bottom and then tap on internal storage like so. And you gotta create a new folder if you haven't done so. Create a new folder. And I want you guys to go ahead and type in Gcam just like this. I want a capital G, capital C, and then a lowercase a and a lowercase m, and that's it. So once you have this folder created, go ahead and tap on it. And I want you guys to create a new folder called configs. Make sure the C is capitalized and everything else is lowercase just like so. You got that? So once you have this go ahead and tap it open. I want you guys to go back to your downloads. Open it up. Okay it seems a little bit tedious but just trust me it, it's pretty simple. So remember that XML file we downloaded? I want you guys to hold that and type on copy. And once you have that copied, go back to storage and go back to the where it says Gcam, open up the configs file, and I want you guys to paste that file over here. So once you have that file pasted, go ahead and open up the Gcam app. And right over here, I want you guys to double tap anywhere over here twice. 
and it's going to ask you to choose your configuration. So the one we just downloaded was called the Hulm V9. Go ahead and tap that and tap on restore like so. Okay, so now we should be good to go. Go ahead, take your photo again. And hopefully it comes out a lot more saturated. So it does seem slightly saturated. I probably should have taken a better picture of something else. Let me go ahead and try that real quick. Okay, so for this photo, this is the default photo with the default settings. And if you guys wanted to use an XML file, this is it. It looks a little bit more bumped up in saturation. But, you know, the default one looks pretty damn good so far. And this one looks slightly brighter. So you guys have to go around and just, you know, go ahead and test out your XML files. Now, this is just a tutorial, just showing you guys how to get this far. Um, as for me, I'm going to go ahead and download some more XML files and I'll do a camera comparison test with those XML files so you guys have a better idea of, you know, what kind of features each file brings. Uh, maybe you guys might like the, you know, the cooler tones of a certain one or maybe you guys might like the more saturation of a certain one. If you guys are able to make it this far, you should be good to go. So this is Gcam, you know, don't feel intimidated. These photos look a lot more sharper than the stock camera app. It's pretty much up to OnePlus to improve this via software updates. So anyways, this is Alter Tech with his quick tutorial on how to install Gcam and get it set up on your OnePlus 7 device or even your OnePlus 7T. It's the same steps. So I hope you guys have a great and wonderful day. And if you guys have any questions or comments, please hit me up down below. This is Alter Tech signing out. Peace.